Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. A video shared on Russian social media platforms, dated February 29, 2024, depicts the crew of a Russian self-propelled mortar, identified as the 2S-41 Drak, reloading and engaging what appears to be Ukrainian positions, as indicated by the VK Post. If confirmed, this marks the inaugural sighting of the new 2S-41 on the Ukrainian front. The deployment of the state-of-the-art 82mm self-propelled mortar, the 2S-41 Drak, by Russian forces in Ukraine signifies a significant development in the conflict. Recently introduced into the Russian military arsenal, this weapon system represents a leap forward in terms of mobility, precision, and firepower, providing frontline units with enhanced capabilities to swiftly and effectively counter threats. The 2S-41 Drak fills the gap between conventional towed mortars and heavier, less maneuverable artillery systems. Its self-propelled nature enables rapid relocation on the battlefield, a critical feature in modern warfare where speed and adaptability are paramount to exploiting enemy vulnerabilities or responding to dynamic frontline shifts. Complementing its mobility is an automated aiming and firing system, bolstering shot accuracy and reducing preparation time. Built on the K4386 Typhoon VDV armored vehicle platform, the 2S-41 Drak houses an 82mm breech-loaded mortar capable of both indirect and direct fire, facilitated by its turret-sufficient depression. This versatility is essential for addressing diverse tactical scenarios encountered in combat. Additionally, a remotely operated weapon station with a 7.62mm machine gun provides close-in protection, enabling the crew to engage targets autonomously of the mortar turret. Furthermore, defense against laser threats is reinforced by two sets of six smoke grenade dispensers mounted on the roof. Setting it apart is its modern fire control system, which calculates firing data to optimize mission accuracy and efficiency. Many pre-firing preparations and other operations are conducted from the combat compartment, leveraging automation to boost operational effectiveness. The 2S-41 can employ both standard 82mm ammunition and next-generation bombs offering extended power and range. A supplementary 82mm mortar, complete with bipod and base plate, is stowed aboard, affording dismounted troops field use flexibility. In terms of specifications, the 2S-41 Drak boasts a maximum firing range of 6,000 meters, with elevation angles spanning 45 to 85 degrees and azimuth angles of plus or minus 35 degrees. Its ammunition complement includes up to 64 82mm bombs and 507.62mm cartridges, supporting a crew of four. Weighing in at 14,500 kg with a payload capacity of 2,500 kg, it achieves speeds of at least 100 km per hour. Russia's consistent pursuit of enhancing its conventional combat capabilities through technological integration into equipment and operational methodologies is evident. The employment of this self-propelled mortar in Ukraine serves as a real-world evaluation of these technological advancements in contemporary conflict scenarios. The introduction of the 2S-41 Drak in Ukraine underscores the ongoing military innovation and adaptation of the Russian armed forces to the evolving landscape of modern warfare. The forthcoming battlefield reports will provide further insight into its performance. That's all for now. See you later.